This video demonstrates the integration of computational analysis capabilities within the interactive visualization system, Jigsaw. A first scenario examines a document collection of all 454 papers from the InfoViz and VAST conferences over the last 15 years. To get an overview, we begin with the list view, display concepts, authors, keywords, and years, and sort the lists by frequency of occurrence. We see that Daniel Keim and John Stasco are the two most prolific authors. If we select Keim and order the lists by entity connection strength, we notice the terms insight, pixel, and text as the most connected concepts, data visualization, and data mining as the most connected keywords, and Schneidewind as the most common co-author. The document cluster view shows the results of a clustering performed by Jigsaw. The papers are grouped into 20 clusters based on their title and abstract. Larger clusters seem to identify popular topics such as visual analytics, social networks, and graphs. Smaller clusters depict focused application domains such as the World Wide Web and gene expression. Because all the views in Jigsaw are connected, selecting Keim in the list view highlights his papers in the cluster view. Six of his papers are in the set map geospatial cluster. Temporal interactions also can be shown by selecting the first five or the last five years of the conferences in the list view and then noting which clusters are most connected. If we select an entire group in the cluster view, we can see its characteristics in the list view. Here, Fiket and Schneiderman are highly connected to the network social exploration cluster. In 2006, this was a hot topic. To investigate further, we can now examine these paper abstracts through the document view. The word cloud at the top shows the most frequently used words in the documents of the cluster. We can glance at the small document summary region to gain a quick sense of the articles. Let's sort the articles by date and rapidly go through the most recent ones. By doing so, we note that most of the vast papers in this set are related to computer networks, whereas most of the InfoViz papers are about social networks. Alternately, we can load all of the papers of a particular author. Here, Tamara Munzner's papers show the terms analysis, graph, layout, and model as prominent words. In 2009, she published the MISB paper about comparative genomics. Since Jigsaw has computed the similarities of all document pairs, we can issue a command to find the most similar papers across the entire collection. Five other papers about genomics or comparative visualization show up. We conclude by exploring the co-author networks of Keim and Stasco mentioned earlier. Issuing the Jigsaw Recommend Related command generates lists of authors, keywords, and other entities connecting those two. Drilling into the author's attribute shows series of papers and authors connecting the two. Keim connects to Karan through North. Stasco connects to Karan through Lee and Dwyer. An expanded view of this network now also can be presented in Jigsaw's graph view. In a second scenario, we explore a collection of car reviews about the 2009 Hyundai Genesis from the Edmunds.com website. To begin, we examine the document grid view and sort and color all the reviews by a sentiment metric Jigsaw computed. Overall, the reviews are quite positive. Blue squares far outnumber the red ones. When we select the four negative reviews as determined by sentiment, we note in the list view that the overall rating of each is very low, thus reinforcing the opinion. By examining connections between these negative reviews and car features, the items phone, seat, and suspension stand out. Perhaps those are features of most concern. If we change the ordering of reviews in the grid to be by date, we notice that the earlier reviews in the last row tend to be more positive, and the more recent ones in the first row include the negative perceptions. Now let's select all reviews in the list view with an overall rating below 6.5. The most frequent car features mentioned in these reviews are engine, noise, seat, suspension, and transmission. Switching back to the grid view, we now display the documents clustered by content and then ordered and colored by sentiment. 
Note how the negative reviews occur in cluster 10 with suspension as a descriptive keyword and cluster 1 with seed as a keyword. These do seem to be potential weaknesses in the car. Choosing all the documents in cluster 10 to be displayed in a document view shows a summary word cloud where indeed suspension is a frequent word. By reading the documents individually, we quickly do begin to understand the negative perceptions of the suspension by these reviewers.